Hello, my name is Jeremy Sanders. I'm a sales engineer here at Seraphic Security. Today I'm going to show you how you might set up policies to govern how end users are allowed to interact with AI model websites on a browser that's protected by Seraphic Security. And to start, we'll browse to ChatGPT. The first thing you'll notice is a warning message pop up. So this is a policy rule that just reminds the end user that it's against company policy to enter company information into ChatGPT. You can see that I'm still allowed to use ChatGPT. I can enter in information into the message bar without any issues. And I can move over to Word. We're going to copy some non-sensitive information that I have down here at the bottom. So I just copy. We'll go back over here to ChatGPT and paste that information in. You can say, see it pasted it in there without any issues, right? No problem there. But if I switch back to this document and I try to copy this code snippet, right, this is actually a C sharp code snippet, and I have a sensitive data policy that is preventing me from pasting any code into ChatGPT. Right, so if I come over here and attempt to paste, you can see I get a block. Right. I'm using that code base sensitive data profile to look for this data on the clipboard, but I can also look for code or other sensitive data profiles inside documents that are either uploaded or downloaded through any Seraphic protected browser. If you want more information about this or to see a more comprehensive demo, please reach out to the Seraphic security sales rep for your area. Thank you.